Hello and welcome to Map Glitches in Venge Part 2. Now, if you haven't seen Part 1, I really recommend that you go and check it out. It is quite a long video, but it is very good because it's got a lot of map glitches. Now, I am recording this before Venge Map Glitches Part 1 is even out because um, basically some of them require the old map glitch spots and... Uh, basically could get patched before I make this video so I decided to make it before I even released part 1. I hope all the glitches in part 1 still work but I do kind of doubt it to be honest. Now Avenged developers, uh, once again I'm sorry and two, if you haven't hired me yet for, to be a game tester or map tester, glitch tester, bug finder, uh, please do because I have broken the map Sierra like completely. Like genuinely, it is fully broken. I can, I can get into every single spot in the game, which I think is absolutely incredible. Check out Map Glitches Part One, and if you have watched that already, then enjoy this video. Right. So the first map glitch is going to be getting up onto that roof there. Now, last time, if you remember, we got up there by going to that platform there, then dashing onto there. And then jumping to there. Now I have found an easier way to get up there. Yeah, so I found an easier way of getting up onto that roof. And it is going to be from this platform again. I can't get up there. And then from this platform, all you need to do, instead of dashing to there and then jumping to there, you can simply dash straight to it. And then there you go, you're up on the roof. Now, this is an easier way of getting up here instead of dashing onto this arch here. But there is another way to get up onto that roof. Now... This is going to require getting up here, and you have to use the dash character for this. So from here, simply dash onto that wall there, and put side on. So there you go, as you can see, side on. Then from here, you're going to need to wait until the cooldown for your dash happens. And then this is the part that's really cool. All you have to do is simply... Yeah, as you can see, I dashed literally into nothing and got up onto the roof. I think this is way easier and way better way of getting up here. Okay, this next one, I'm not going to lie, I actually discovered this map glitch accidentally. I was trying to dash from this platform down there, but I ended up hitting this and that sent me flying up into the air. Then, uh, when that happened, I went straight through that thing, as you remember maybe from last video there is nothing in the middle so I realized that I could simply do the same thing and dash onto the end part there and I fell off but basically that sends you flying up into the air and then I realized there's a way easier way of getting up onto that pillar then yeah and as you can see I'm up on here now there's an invisible wall right here and it follows along like here but I don't really like I don't like this part here I like sh jumping straight onto this wall and basically follow follow this wall now be very careful here um, but basically yeah follow the wall now this leads to a very very cool spot which is right here I don't know if you guys can see this or understand what is going on but uh, Basically, you're invisible. Yeah, like seriously, you're genuinely invisible. You're I'm basically inside that thing there, but inside this one. Now you can carry on, and that is going to lead to a very better place. Um, this is going to lead here. From here, you can jump onto here, which is once again very, very, very cool. From here, you can jump onto this wall here and shoot people from here which once again very cool but there is something even better 
If we jump back, um, you can see that there's an invisible wall right here because my bullets have been stopped. But there isn't one right there because my bullets, as you can see, they're going through. So what we have to do is basically dash there and kind of control yourself from midair and land here. Here, there's once again this invisible wall right here and there's one right here. But there is nothing here, which is very, very good. As you can see, I can destroy all these parts, meaning there is nothing here. Uh, you can also jump onto there, but I don't know why you want to do that. Then, from here, for those of you wondering, uh, yeah, there's some visible wall right here as well. But something very cool that I discovered is that if you go right to the very edge and you basically dash and jump at the same time, you're on this wall here. And then you can jump again and then, yeah, wait, there. Yeah, there's even higher invisible wall. And yeah, basically, you can get anywhere you want. You're on top of this thing. You can also jump onto that platform. Okay, you have to dash onto this platform. But yeah, that is pretty much it. That is Sierra completely broken. Okay, now the way I actually realise how you can get up onto the wall there is through boosting. Now, to boost is when you have a character and another character, usually your friend, uh, that basically jumps on top of your head and they can get up somewhere higher and where they're not meant to be. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. As you can see, there is uh, T Craig 478 inside that wall there. Now, he's actually peeking a bit. You can actually see him. Uh, if he moves over to his right, I believe. As you, Yeah, there you go. He's literally invisible and you can't see him, but he can see us and there you go. He killed me, which is really cool because it shows that this is an OP spot and that is basically it for the video guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are going to be using these map glitches to break the game. And yeah, that is it. Don't forget to subscribe, smash like and all that BS. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thomas, you're going to need to kill me. I'm fucking stuck. <laughs>